Welcome to the Daily Prophetic Word, and the Daily Prophetic Word for Tuesday, the 23rd of July, 2019, is Support My Prophets. Before we start, please share, like, subscribe, and click the bell icon, so that everybody will know about our messages and the videos. And please also watch all of our videos at the YouTube channel. There is a lot of information inside there. Please follow us on our website and become a member at www.triple-grace.com Just sign up with your email and the password. Then you have access to all the resources. Let me make a quick announcement. Today our video about the Great Exodus will be of about our mission to Cambodia. Some very interesting information that I will give regarding our upcoming mission to Cambodia in August. Now let us continue with the daily prophetic word. Support my prophets. I have sent you prophets to restore the will of the Father on the earth again. Dark places will see the light of glory. <clears throat> but you have rejected my prophets and my messages, and refused to come out of the world and Babylon. If you do not follow my calling, you will receive the same punishment as Jezebel. Support my prophets. My prophets are on a mission to the nations, to bring the love of my father to all people. I have asked you for your support and assistance, but you have refused to share your resources. If you continue to deny my prophets the rewards, then I will bring calamities and disasters over you and your children. Listen to my prophets and support their missions in the nations, because they fulfill my commandments and the call of my father. Support my prophets. And this was a daily prophetic word for Tuesday, the 23rd of July, 2000. And 19 was given by the Holy Spirit. Now let us continue with our book of love and of the 95 Thesis, the restoration and reformation of the church. Mm. Yeah, number nine, I believe. Praise the Lord in unity. Support one another with love and understanding. Stand for the needy, the poor, the suffering, the nameless and faceless, and lift them up in the name of God the Father. Let me continue with the next one. I believe this one we had yesterday. I'm not sure. I, get, may, may, I might be confused about it. So let's continue with number 10. Trust in the Lord for your salvation and walk in the footsteps of Jesus, in the same way as he walked the earth. You will also find the 95 Theses that we have in this book on our website. www.grace.com You can become a member, you can have access to all the resources that we have there. Now let's go to the daily uh, to the philosophical pointer. <clears throat> the next will be when the rose finally blossoms in this world, we will have no borders, no countries, no governments, and no different religions anymore. The rose stands as a symbol of God's love. We will continue with the next philosophical pointer and see this tomorrow and also a new prophetic word given by the Holy Spirit will be available for you tomorrow. <clears throat> Please, we are going to our mission to Cambodia in August. It will be not an easy mission. So please watch the video in our Great Exodus series and help us with your support. We need supporters, benefactors, sponsors that will give us the ability to give out Bibles, to make 
meetings, to make prayer meetings, to gather the people together, to help the needy, to show for the love of the Father within Cambodia. So if you are feeling and have a heart for this mission, then please help us with your donations. I will put a link for all this in the first pinned comment. Follow the links and then you can open your heart and give us your donations to an act of love, uh, of loving kindness. We will go forward to Cambodia in August. And many people are waiting for us to show them the light there. But let me not explain everything here now, but follow me to the video in the Great Exodus series. The topic will be our mission to Cambodia. Thank you for listening to this daily prophetic word. My name is Michael. I'm the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Pass Movement Foundation. May God bless you and your family abundantly. And I hope I will see you again tomorrow. Maranatha.